Luxury, comfort, convenience. Everything you need under one roof. Four Points by Sheridan Tallahassee Downtown. The Florida Current, an online news service smartly covering politics and policy. Subscribe for free daily alerts at thefloridacurrent.com. Before you crack open a cold one, some lawmakers think consumers should know what the product tastes like. Beer distributors support the measure and say it's a great way to promote a product. Tastings is a great way for consumers to get to know the different products on the marketplace. A state Senate committee has approved the bill removing prohibitions on beer samplings at vendors in Florida. Susan Pittman with Drug Free Duval is against the idea. She hopes the proposal never makes it to the governor's desk. You can conceivably see a mom could be at Publix, do a beer tasting, get in her car with her three kids and have some kind of a serious accident on the way home. Concerns were raised over whether tastings could occur in convenience stores, something that will be worked out later. Another bill was temporarily postponed Thursday. That proposal would allow malt beverages to be sold in 64 ounce growlers. Currently, consumers are allowed to purchase them in 32 ounce and 120 ounce containers. Senator Jack Latvala is behind the growler bill. And I don't see how we can uh, in good conscience say how we're for less regulation and then tell people, you know, down to the ounce what sizes they have to pour in their craft breweries. Those in support and against the bill both agree on one thing. We just want to make sure that it's done responsibly in terms of uh, beer tastings. Similar proposals have been introduced in the Florida House. In Tallahassee, I'm Mount Horn reporting.